uh, well, I guess we decided that we were not going to lose. And then it was a good feeling when we turned the game. How crazy was it when you saw the fin shoot for the empty net and have it go off the side of the net? Yeah, I was kind of nervous, but we got it under control. You uh, got your first goal of the U18 Women's World. Uh, can, can you describe what happened on the play? Uh, well, I crashed in it and got a great pass from Tuba. So, all thanks to her. <laughs> Do you feel like you guys have been getting a little bit better with every game at this tournament? Yeah, absolutely. We've come together uh, for every game and become stronger. That play with Tuba where you crashed, is that something you've practiced? The timing on that? Uh, oh, yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> how, how confident do you guys feel now going into the playoffs after winning a game like this? Yeah, this uh, builds our self-confidence up. So. We're excited. Thank you. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Getting uh, Mira Jungarker back in the lineup. How, how nice was that? Yeah, uh, she's a good player, so it's it's good for us. And uh, yeah. <laughs> we're good. We're good. Sure. Yeah. All right. I guess we're good. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Hey, Mira, what did you think was the key to winning today? Uh, <laughs> we play like a team, and uh, yeah. It seemed like you guys never stopped uh, believing right till the end to, to win the way you did. Are we fighting to the end? And uh, you see, when Jena scored uh, the last goal, it was uh, seven uh, seconds left. So, yeah. How about your goal? You made a pretty nice move to uh, score there. Oh, um, I don't know. I don't know what I did really. <laughs> Just uh, shoot the puck. It felt like you guys were shooting faster. Like, was that part of the plan to not hold on to the puck, but take those quick shots? Use yeah. the screen. Yeah. Uh, it's a little bit. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, 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 it's a smaller rink. Yeah. So, so we talked about uh, to shoot the puck more, um, make the uh, small chances to big chances. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You were using your wrister quite a bit. There was the. You missed on the power play, it was loud, and then you scored using the same. Like, was Du missar först i powerplay, men sen sköt du likadant uh, när du gör det målet. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Okej. <Okay. laughs> Second time is a charm. Yes. <laughs> uh, I guess is the extra attacker, the six on five, is that something you practiced a lot as a team? Or just you were all feeling really good about it today and scored those two goals? Oh, we had, I think we had uh, a good feeling. and. Uh, yeah, we know we that we can uh, when we believe it. Uh, uh, yeah. yeah. Do, you, do you feel like the confidence has built through these games, and you're sort of more prepared for the? Have confidence. At the first that we have the match when we play against them. Yeah, I think so. Um, I think we came up with a big self confidence today. Yeah. So. Thank you. Tuva Kendall. Tuva. Yeah, Tuva. Well, congratulations. That was a pretty amazing uh, win for the team. Uh, what can you say about the game? Yeah, it was a very nice win. win. Um, I think we fought it until the end, and that was our goal today. Is playing with six attackers something you guys have uh, practiced a lot? You obviously did very well with uh, the empty net. Yeah. 
I haven't practiced on it, but I feel like we all just fight it to the end. So. You had a big addition to the lineup today with uh, Mira Jungacker coming back. What does she mean to the team? She's a very good ice hockey player and we, we really needed her. So that was very nice. You did a lot in transition and, and in dishing the puck. What did you see during today's game that kind of helped you um, get on the score, you know, have those assists and be able to do, dish those pucks? What does that mean? <laughs> you, um, you had a lot of passes in transition yeah, through yeah. the neutral zone. And yeah. Just how was the game for you? What were you seeing to make those passes? Yeah, I mean, it, the neutral zone is a bit smaller here from Sweden. So when we like skated up with the puck, we were pretty up in the offensive zone pretty fast and then we got some fast passes and, and good chances on the goal so yeah. And then I guess just how did it how did it feel for the team to just tie it up really late in the game on that first extra attacker goal? It was very nice. We we were are very happy now and we needed it uh, for the quarterfinal tomorrow. Yeah, you guys kind of played your best game of the tournament. Do you yeah. feel like you've been building toward this, or was it like our backs against the wall, let's put it all out there? No, I feel like we have been uh, playing better and better, as you said, mm -hmm. and uh, this was the best game, this tournament. What do you think you learned that you can use in the quarterfinals? As I said, we need to fight through the whole game, mm -hmm. and not let them uh, do any fast goals in the first period or so. Yeah. Thank you. Perfect. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Keep them focused and no, fighting for the end. Especially to believe in it and play smart, uh, play simple, but also go for it. Like we needed to score and uh, the girls believed in it when we told them <laughs> that we do. So, yeah, it's, we were excited to see the hard work too. And we were really going for it. How do you keep them on a little bit of an even keel? I mean, obviously they're very excited right now, but yeah. you've still got some important games yeah, coming up. Yeah, for sure. This is just... Uh, um, one step, or how do you say it? One step up the road. No, I don't mm -hmm. want to say. Yeah. Like, yeah, we keep climbing. So um, uh, it was great for our confidence, and we know we can beat Finland. And um, we grew during this game too, and we kept believing in it. And we know it's an important game tomorrow as well. So uh, it's step by step, and uh, we're go going from there. There was a long video review on the uh, winning goal. Where were you guys confident that it was going to count? Yeah, uh, of course we were still believing in it that <laughs> it was a goal, so we didn't think too much about it. and was just hoping that it was going to be a good call. Even without the excitement of the win, you have to be happy with how like this is the best your team has looked at the tournament. Yeah. They really came out and showed what they're capable of. Yeah, I think uh, we stepped up this game and uh, played as a team. Mm -hmm. uh, we worked on small things uh, that we needed to get better on. Uh, we know it's a long tournament too, so uh, uh, these girls haven't played against US or Canada ever before. So um, they're good skaters, but we are also good skaters. So for these girls to believe in it, like we can beat any team here. And you beat a team that beat Canada, there's that sort of like, okay, we can yeah, but exactly, like anything can happen. Mm -hmm. It's usually one game now when it's the important games. Mm -hmm. So that's what you keep got to keep believing in and uh, bring the best out of every individual out there. So, uh, yeah, it's a process and we're still working on it. And with the off day yesterday, what did you guys do yesterday with your time? Uh, we had some uh, yoga, actually. <laughs> it was pretty rainy outside, so mm -hmm. we stayed inside in the beginning of the day and uh, did some team building stuff and had some fun too. Uh, so that was good for the group to come together and uh, went for some walk when it got better weather outside. So I think it was a good day off. We had two tough games before that US and Canada. So uh, we came in with good energy here today.